Four years ago, Trinity through the Legacy Foundation was gifted a 26.8 acre farm just down the street from the church known as Helen's Acres. Now, if that's news to you, you're probably thinking, what would a church do with a farm? Well, the quick answer is a whole lot of good. Every year, literally, tons of fruit and vegetables are grown to support the Kelowna Food Bank and other organizations. One of the goals of Helen's Acres is that the food bank would never be in need of fresh produce. And we are well on our way. This is Darcy Smith, our resident farmer. Helen's Acres this spring is very exciting. We have uh, lots of volunteers coming out, which is good because we're not only building community by developing our picnic area so that we'll be able to have a spot for volunteers to be able to enjoy fellowship together, but we're increasing the amount of uh, planting we're doing on our land. We feel that there's unprecedented demand that our uh, partner, the food bank, is facing, and uh, we want to be there to support them. So we've planted a lot more of our acreage in uh, a lot of staples, potatoes, carrots, onions. We've also expanded things like melons and uh, uh, cantaloupe. And uh, of course, we have our raspberries that we're standing in and our strawberries. Last year, we donated between ourselves and our partners 175,000 pounds of food. This year, our target is to be well over 200,000 pounds and probably closer to 225,000 pounds of food. And on top of all that food, there's even a chicken coop providing fresh eggs. Dozens of volunteers show up every week to make the farm run. And then just recently, a cool story emerged with Teen Challenge. Now, Teen Challenge is an addictions recovery program that we've had a long partnership with. Yes, yeah, so we had a, a generous donor donate uh, some funds for us to be able to um, hire the Teen Challenge crew to come out and work alongside us to do some farming to help us clean up the rest of Helen's Acres because there's still some cleanup to do. And it helps the, uh, the Teen Challenge House to be able to finance a lot of the activities there and the programs to help uh, the gentleman to be able to uh, you know, get healed. So it, when it comes to the side of recovery, it really does help to know that what I'm doing is going to go in to benefit somebody else who may not be quite as fortunate as I am. I love being in the middle of our city uh, having a quiet, beautiful piece of land that can produce uh, beautiful, wonderful vegetables, berries. And to be able to do this, to be able to support people in need, that just warms my heart. God is at work growing good things in our community. Small acts of kindness through people helping farm some land. A donation to help men in their recovery process that in turn will produce food to serve our community and a vision to help us care for each other. In a season where it's hard to find good news, if we look for it, God is doing great things.